Here we go, only one more round left to go in the timed race regulation. I'm very excited to get into the playoffs of this tournament. It has been a great regulation, and now, just so close to the playoffs, it'll be amazing. The playoffs and the timed race are a bit complicated. I guess I, I might explain that in this video. Actually, why well, I will. So, basically how the timed race playoffs is going to work is of course there's going to be 10 marbles going the four division winners will be going to the division winner bracket and the six wild card marbles will be going to the wild card bracket so i guess you um, so i guess you know what a regular black bracket works well in, in the uh division winner bracket uh in the first round four plays one three plays two and as you know uh, the second marble that goes um, in the game is the advantage marble so I guess they'd have more advantage games in the series. They're going to be, be every series in the time race playoffs will be best of five, except for the championship, which is going to be best of seven. So the winner of the division winner bracket will go to the championship automatically, and regardless of their seed number, they would have the advantage in that championship if they made it at the division winner bracket. The winner of the wild card bracket will be going to the championship qualifier bracket with the other three division winners that did not uh, win in the division winner bracket. So we're going to set up the, the uh, championship qualifier bracket with those four marbles and, and who, and for, to set up to play the uh, division winner bracket champion in the championship. So based on their records and tiebreakers from the, reg from the regulation, we're going to determine the seed numbers, what they're going to be for the championship qualifier bracket. So I guess the wild card marble it might not be... Uh, play in the best marble in the championship qualifier bracket. It could be another one of the division winners. Um, I mean, like he got colors swirling there at six, four, and one, and leading division C and clear yellow star up there at eight, two, and one, and second place in the division. So, I guess that, that that's that's pretty good way to explain it. And then the championship is between the championship qualifier bracket champion and the division winner bracket champion. The division winner bracket champion will automatically get the advantage in the series. All right, so let's talk about more about the time race. We got. We don't have that much time, so we are so Green Yellow Swirl has clinched the division, and so he doesn't have to worry about losing the division. Um, he um, and then we uh, we got the best of the round tomorrow between Everywhere Else One Clear Yellow Star. That's basically the Division A Championship game. Whoever wins that game is going to be the Division A champion and will be the regulation champion. So I guess we'll see what, who's going to win. That should be an exciting one. And they went to just very, very much watching. Click the link down in the description so you could. See the schedules for round 12. This is a good video to explaining the playoffs, and I guess I'll see y'all. I guess I'll see y'all soon.